This is number 54 Pickmere Road, Hamforth. Situated within a short walk of the village centre and the train station in catchment for Hamforth Grange Primary School as well as being near to the A555 There's a block paved driveway which provides off-road parking to the front A lovely entrance hall with laminate flooring and staircase ascending to first floor level. Lounge with electric fire, ceiling coving. A refitted kitchen with breakfast bar for informal dining, fitted with modern white units with an integrated electric double oven and gas hob, space and plumbing for washing machine and fridge and freezer. It's an understairs storage cupboard. Property is extended and features a dining and sitting room accessed directly off the kitchen. There are French doors that open out onto the rear garden. Property is double glazed, gas fired centrally heated, run by a Valiant combination central heating boiler. Plenty of LED downlighters. First floor level. Double bedroom. Bathroom. Fitted with modern white sanitary ware with thermostatically controlled shower fittings over the bath, landing with boiler cupboard, spacious main bedroom with ample space for fitted furniture. Third bedroom. Got a staircase which ascends to a converted loft room.
So it's worth stressing that this room is not done to building regulations. Um, but obviously, as you can see, is currently utilised as an occasional fourth bedroom with Vulux roof windows, heating and under eaves storage. Take you down and show you the rear garden. Also worth mentioning that the property is within walking distance of Meryton Road Park and is ideally positioned for access to Wilmslow Town Centre, Manchester International Airport and the local and national motorway networks. It's a good sized rear garden with paved patio area. Timber fence boundaries, timber shed, secondary stone patio area. And as you can see, properties benefited from a double storey extension to the rear. Properties on the market available to view. Give us a call on 01625 444 899. Thanks for watching.